Uh, advertising is a vast military operation. Openly and brashly intended to conquer. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation. Openly and brashly intended to conquer. The human spirit. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation. Openly and brashly intended to conquer the human spirit. We don't understand information movement and image making as warfare at all. We call this advertising. Actually, Madison Avenue is a major military operation, vastly aggressive, and uh, out to conquer uh, empires, territories within the human heart, the human senses. It is a huge military operation uh, of empire building and icon making. Um, if we had the slightest consciousness of social responsibility, instead of just a sort of a private subconscious, um, totally inadequate to our technology, we would teach our children in our schools how to protect themselves against uh, media fallout and advertising fallout. Hello, I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC. Oh. In a time like this, where the written word and the spoken word uh, through commercial media reaches millions of people with tremendous force, with the prestige of huge agencies of expression behind them, it seems above all important that intense training in language is demanded if the society is to retain its health. Well, hey, I... The critics of advertising miss the bus entirely by complaining about false claims. But, nice. Yeah, it's just a little something to hold my slow jams. Nothing could be more or less important than the false claims in advertising. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, and it works so seamlessly with iTunes. You should check out iMovie. I... It is the total icon-making activity that matters. Photo iWeb, because they all work like I... A programmed teaching machine. iTunes, you know, oh. I like... Icon-making... Comes on every man. A programmed teaching machine. I like icon making. Well, I a programmed teaching machine. I have some very icon making cool apps that are bun. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation, openly and brashly intended to conquer the human spirit. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation, openly and brashly intended to conquer the human spirit. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation, openly and brashly intended to conquer the human spirit. Uh, advertising is a vast military operation. In a time like this, where the written word and the spoken word uh, through commercial media reaches millions of people with tremendous force, with the prestige of huge agencies of expression behind them, it seems above all important that intense training in language is demanded if the society is to retain its health. It's, it's simply fantastic, the unconsciousness of our Western world with regard to the forces that uh, we release upon it. And uh, the little areas in which we permit ourselves any consciousness or responsibility are, are minute compared to the real areas of impact. We don't understand information movement and image making as warfare at all. We call this advertising. Actually, Madison Avenue is a major military operation, vastly aggressive, and uh, out to conquer uh, empires, territories within the human heart, the human senses. It is a huge military operation uh, uh, of empire building and icon making. Um, if we had the slightest consciousness of social responsibility, instead of just a sort of a private subconscious, uh, totally inadequate to our technology, we would teach our children in our schools how to protect themselves against uh, media fallout and advertising fallout. <laughs> Vast military operation. A programmed teaching machine. Out to conquer. Icon making.
social responsibility, we would teach our children how to protect themselves against uh, media fallout and advertising fallout. And in, 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 in the degree that these men are icon makers, they certainly, these agency men, they, they certainly have the right to call themselves creative artists. Uh, whether they perform a good, benign social function is open to question, but as, as creators of tremendous effects, uh, they are artists. Remember, an artist is primarily concerned with getting your attention. Whether he's a poet or a musician, his first, in, uh, his first uh, wish and hope is to trap your attention. There is, this is the first hope and wish of every advertiser. He is an artist, certainly, to that extent. He, he wants to shape your attention, to shape your sensibilities, to create an effect upon you. Whether you believe a word he says it couldn't matter less to him. He is interested only in effects, and not in changing your opinions or thoughts about anything. And this is also true of a poet. Couldn't care less what you thought or felt about him or anything, as long as you get the effect you want.